Welcome back to my channel, Ashley here. So if you're new, thank you for tuning in, welcome. If you're an OG, as usual, thank you for the continued support. Also guys, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that bell notification button so you know when I upload. So guys, today I am bringing you a Fenty Beauty review. I picked up some of the new Gloss Bomb Heats and the Fenty Beauty Bomb Posse eyeshadow palette. So if you'd like to see how I got this eye look and this bomb lip combo, stay tuned. So what the people have been waiting for, we all know like we know Fenty for complexion, okay? We know them for body lava, we know them for skin, like it's always skin. But we don't really necessarily know them for eyeshadow, so I'm really interested to see how this is. I don't really have too many Fenty eyeshadows except for like the kilowatts, and then I use that for shadows and on and like for a highlight. So this is the Fenty Bomb Posse palette, and it has 12 shades some shimmers and some mattes super pretty uh first thoughts i will say i don't see a lot of transition shades for my crease but i do see something that i can utilize and the 12 shades are oh this is tiny honey uh, the 12 shades are vanilla cake ballerina cinnabutter lebrons nude beach beverly chills fussy rock and rose fenty glow Bake buns hot chocolate and get this bread so get this bread is this deep chocolate color back here and I definitely feel like I'm gonna go into that first it loves me a little smoky all right morphe m519 brush and I believe nude beach which is that nude color here as I said there's not too many transition shades so that's really the closest there's a little fallout from swiping the shadow, which is expected, but that's fine. I'm just gonna pop this right in my crease. I do see it showing up. It's not as deep as I would like it to be, but that's fine. It's workable. So that is Nude Beach. Now I'm going to go in with Get This Bread and my Outer V. I'm going to go in with my Morphe M433 brush for that color. And I'm just going to stamp that right in the outer V and sweep it in. So next, I'm going with my NYX Glitter Goo Primer. If you don't have this, definitely get it. Uh, I really feel like all of your shimmers pop with this. I use this with all of my shimmers. Some of my shimmers I can use without it, but why not add the extra drama? So I'm just gonna add this on my lid, and I think I'm, I think I'm gonna go with hot chocolate, maybe. So now I am just applying hot chocolate on the lids. I will say, oh, I don't know, this is a little hard to pick up. Yeah, so I think the shimmers are a little hard to pick up, but let's see, oh, this is pretty. And now you see how the NYX glitter glue like intensifies the pigment. But I am blending out the edges of that with my, with the same brush that I use in my crease, the M519 brush with Nude Beach, just so that it is seamless. I think I might, you know what, I think I'm going to pop a little the bronze in the corner. So now all we need is lashes. 
So I popped on my lashes and finished my complexion. Now we're going to go into the lips. I got two new gloss balm heats in Fussy and Fenty Glow. Now I already have the original, uh, the Fenty creams, the gloss balm creams, bomb. So of course I had to pick up the heat. I didn't get the cherry, it sold out and then you know, I don't like glossy red. It kind of gives me red light district, so you know I didn't pick it up. But when I saw that they came out with these, had to get it. And I really hope that they make new ones. Uh, I'm going in with my chestnut liner for my lips, but one thing I will say is, is Fenty gonna give us lip liners? Cause I feel like we need that. So Fenty, if you hear me out there, please give your girls some lip liners. We need it. So I'm going to go with chestnut and line my lips. So I'm going to go with my Huda Beauty Borsi Browns in Raja. This is one of my favorites. So I'm pretty sure you saw this in my last favorites video. Bomb. Love these lippies. And now that that's on, I'm going to go with Fenty Glow Gloss Balm Heat. So they say it's supposed to be plumping with the vitamin E and shea butter in here. Uh, these lippies definitely make your lips feel moisturized. And it smells really good too. So overall guys, for my thoughts in terms of the palette, the eyeshadow palette, you probably already have something like this in your collection. So is it a must? Do you need to run out and go get it? Not necessary. Um, I did see some of the reviews for the palette and they gave them like a 2 out of 5 stars. So you do sometimes have to work with some palettes and that's why I use my NYX Glitter Glue Primer. And it just brings it out. So therefore I don't really have any issues with the shimmers. I will say that it could have more transition shades in this palette. I didn't feel like I had enough for my skin complexion. First the gloss balm heats. Of course you need them. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you no, um, you definitely need these. I love Fenty's gloss bombs. I pretty much have almost all of them. Um, I'm just missing the hot chocolate and I definitely feel like I'm going to pick that up as well. But yeah, you need these. These you need, for sure. So other than that guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick review. And as usual, until next time, thanks for watching.